I am so thankful for Blue Heron for putting on this production. They have worked very hard behind the scenes, kitchen table here in Los Angeles. They have a studio, but it hasn't been easy. They did a great job. I hope those of you who are still online can see this great new slide. It came from AFL-CIO keynote speaker, uh, Rebecca Rendell today. AFL has stood up a fabulous letter writing campaign. Click the link, send your message to Congress, and we would love to have your support. Yes, in the program, you can catch all of the bios. You can see exactly what's going on, read the letters discussed, and gather so much knowledge. This program is free online. Tonight, it's going to be more about art and advocacy. My dear friend and the musical artist Jordan Zivon is going to be entertaining us tonight with uh, five other musicians. So there'll be three songs played. It's not to be missed. It does start at 4.30. So grab a, a iced tea or something and come back. It is, we're going to be honoring some amazing people. And you can see from this slide that there so many stakeholders come to help ADIO and we help others. And our award ceremony is no different. We want to thank those people who have stood by ADIO and fought for our mission and vision as we work to help them. Very quickly tonight, we are going to honor Congress, former Congressman John Chimkus and Congressman Paul Tonko, the American Federation of Teachers. You heard them talk today and you heard the journalists speak about the great work they do. All of the Band Asbestos Now supporters like Abrea and Barry and so many others will be recognized tonight. Dr. Jackie Moline spoke in session two. She's a rock, medical rock star. Judd Apatow dedicated Record Store Day to ADAO and Jordan will present him an award. Barry Robson and Robert Sussman, my dear friends, this award used to be saved for somebody who was a victim, a warrior. It's not anymore. There's so many people that help us that share the same vision. I'm sure Barry and Robert call themselves warriors as well. We'll also have a moment to thank Wendy, Rebecca, and Julie as awards will be presented by the people that made the introductions. And then we have our sponsors. Let's face it, these sponsors, is, sponsors keep us going for the entire year. I am grateful that they believe in our work. They support every effort along the way. The Simmons, Hanley Conroy firm, Todd Adamitis will accept the Platinum Sponsor Award. Sarah Salger from the Gory Law Firm will accept their Gold Award. And Chris Meisenkoten will accept the award for early Lucarelli, Sweeney, and Meisenkoten. We don't make referrals. They do this out of the goodness of their heart. Let's take a look at these logos. When you see them, I want you to recognize they support ADO. They want nothing back and they support because they know it's the right thing to do for their clients and our shared future. Special thanks to my dear friend, Ellen. She's probably in her pajamas because we started early this morning, but there are very few people who would stand by and hold my hand and walk this journey. She is remarkable to make this conference possible. Uh, our leadership boards, we have three. And yes, we all work so hard and work hard together. And you heard Celeste speak. You'll hear Jordan play. And obviously so many others yesterday. We have a science advisory board. Many of them spoke today. They are leading experts in the U.S. and around the world. Our prevention team led by Brent Kynock. He kicked off session four, and you can see how connected ADIO is with the people who really make a difference. That being said, I just want you to know we are really grateful for the opportunity to share our knowledge with you and to partner for prevention as we move forward. So this concludes this day two of our academic conference, but it's really important you don't go too far. We're going to start the award ceremony. And Jordan and his colleagues are going to play Lawyers, Guns, and Money. So join us for a little bit of fun and awards as we recognize those who help us. And for everyone that worked so hard today, my sincere thanks. This concludes our academic conference. Thank you.